if you're a teenager, how to choose a career path? Splash dream. Okay, so this is for teenagers. If you are studying and you're wondering what to do, first thing, so I'm assuming you're in secondary school, lah. Okay, what do you want to do for your life? Your parents is probably asking you, boy, girl, what do you want to do? Or maybe they're already telling, uh, you know, telling you like pick something. Okay, how do you choose? Okay, this uh, I'm gonna share with you about my story, and maybe you can learn a thing or two from me, from my mistakes, and you know, maybe you can take a new take take your new action from there. Okay, all right. So when I was 17, actually when I was a kid, right, my parents wanted me to be a piano teacher because uh, you know I like to play piano. You know, they know they know I'm the stay-at-home kind of guy. I like to, you know, play piano lah. So they said, okay, you be a piano teacher. So I was like, okay, I'll be a piano teacher. But, you know, I had no idea what I wanted to do. So I just did what people wanted me to do. Now, um, and then I met someone. And then what uh, she told me was, oh, piano teacher are for girls. Piano teaching is for women. It's a women's job. Okay, you should be an engineer. So, all right, made sense. So I became an engineer. Okay, it was okay lah. I did okay. I passed. Then when I was working, I did all right. Okay, I was a civil engineer, by the way. So, civil engineers are the ones who design the drainage systems, uh, design buildings, so that it so that it does doesn't fall. Okay. All right. So as an engineer, seven years as an engineer, I realized that it wasn't what I wanted to do. Okay. I had. I really wasn't happy with where I was, but one of the problems is I stayed on the same job for seven years. I should have quit much earlier. The moment I realized it wasn't what I wanted. Okay. Now. Let's go back to what we are talking about, choosing a career for yourself. Okay, lesson number one is if you have no direction, someone's going to give you some direction. It's either you're doing what you want or you're going to do what somebody else wants. It's very simple, okay? Uh, so you need to do your research. Number two is do your research. Make sure that it is you are fully aware of what you're getting yourself into okay because there's no guarantee in your life that it is going to you are going to like what you do there's no guarantee in life that this is what you want okay the only way to know is that do it but at least you make an informed decision and you do it and you make your risk do your research okay do your research you can there's a few ways to do your research you can either use the google you know or you can ask someone who is already do like in the industry now. For example, let's say if I were to, if I want, if I could turn back time, okay, I want to be an engineer. I would look for an engineer, and ask him what he does, how is his life, how is the working life like. You know, is this something that you are ready for? If you are fine, then by all means go ahead. Okay, do your research. Then the next one is check the income range okay check the income range because uh sometimes you won't want to just rely on passion and interest sometimes you want to make sure that it pays um passion and interest doesn't pay okay and uh, okay i'm going to give you some example now for example like say someone is passionate about uh, 3d animation how much is he paid okay check that out someone wants to be a sales personnel how much is he paid check that out okay because the moment you start working that excitement and passion will disappear somehow okay 
okay it's gonna be a routine that you are going to you know do repeat every single day okay so make sure that it brings in the income that you want because let's say if you're doing some this if you're doing something that you like congratulations but if it's not bringing in the money that you want you're gonna hate it you are going to hate it so much and complain that you don't deserve this life you know life sucks it's not fair you know and then do what you like love what you do it's going to be a bullshit to you all right so these are just some of the things that um some some pointers for you if you're looking for a career and now if here's a just a tip okay now if i could go back and redo everything from scratch again i would choose to be i would choose to i wouldn't be an engineer okay um i would choose to be a business owner and entrepreneur or i, I would be in sales because in everything i realized that uh, after about a decade 10 plus years of working sales is the key sales is the key in everything whether you are doing your own business you need sales to get new clients okay or even if you are in uh, working as an employee you need to sell yourself you need to sell yourself to your potential boss you need to sell yourself to your boss every single day okay you need to sell yourself to your colleagues now what do you mean by sell yourself that means you need to show why you're so good you know what are the benefits of being around you okay so this uh this is what i would do if i could redo it all over again okay sales that would be another video in fact i have a video of um, not liking to do sales so just check it out on my channel Alright, so I really hope this has been um, informative for you. If you know anyone who is looking for a career, okay, they need some tips and guidelines on what to do, send them this video. Okay, send them this video um, and I want you to like my video, okay, subscribe to my channel. Okay, I'm growing my channel right now. Okay, it's, it's, we, gotta, we all have to start somewhere, right? Okay, so like my video subscribe to my channel if you have anything you want to let me know comment below okay this will be on facebook this will be on youtube there's a comment section below just comment and i will reply you okay i will reply you so at this point i will still reply you lah because i'm still growing okay so peace okay sean louis here and anything you want me to know comment below see you in the next video bye bye